क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन ऑन पेज नंबर सिक्सटी सेवन शर्मा लिमिटेड हैज परचेज अ मशीन फॉर रुपीज सिक्सटी सेवन थाउजेंड ऑन वन फोर ट्वेल्व इंस्टॉलेशन एक्सपेंसिस फॉर द मशीन इज थ्री थाउजेंड डेप्रिसिएशन हैज टू बी प्रोवाइड टेन परसेंट एंड एवरी ईयर अंडर रिड्यूसिंग बैलेंस मैथड नाउ फ्रॉम ईयर वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट अंडर द मैथड ऑफ डेप्रिसिएशन A certain amount of depreciation past journal entry, prepared machinery account, and depreciation account for first three years, and shows the accounting effect in annual account in first two years. So here I am ready with all the information which is given in the question. So here we are going to calculate only one machine depreciation, but the matter is reducing balance matter. Now, as we can see, the purchase main price of machine is sixty seven thousand, and installation charge is three thousand. Here comes the value. Seventy thousand on one fourth two thousand twelve. So on seventy thousand, if we remove depreciation for the year one fourth twelve, the machine cost price is seventy thousand. And if we remove depreciation under reducing balance method, we'll get seven thousand. This calculation you can do in your calculator. So here seven thousand, which will be get minus on thirty first March two thousand thirty. Year value seventy minus seven thousand, it would be sixty three thousand, which will be the opening balance for the next year. That is sixty three thousand. Now, in reducing balance matter, we can't continue with the depreciation one every year. We have to calculate every year depreciation on the opening balance. So here we'll take sixty three thousand and remove ten percent on it. You will get six thousand three hundred depreciation for the year ended thirty first March two thousand fourteen. So here we get minus with six thousand three hundred. If we minus sixty three thousand minus six thousand three hundred, we get the value of fifty six thousand seven hundred, which would be the opening of the first April two thousand fourteen. Fifty six thousand seven hundred. So on again on opening balance, we'll remove. Depreciation under reducing balance matter that is ten percent. So here we get value five thousand six hundred and seventy. Five thousand six hundred and seventy get minus on thirty first March two thousand fifteen. So here the value remain is fifty one thousand and thirty. So this is how we'll complete with the first, second, and third year, which is given in the question. We have to prepare machinery and depreciation for the three years. So this is how we'll calculate in reducing balance, reducing balance matter. Now I'll show you in machinery account directly how you can do it. Just take the date when the machine has been purchased, one four twelve, to bank account. That is. Sixty-seven thousand to cash account three thousand. Year the year ended on thirty-first March two thousand thirteen. The total of this directly we can take seventy thousand ten percent. That is by depreciation account for this year will be seven thousand. If we make the total of both the side. We'll find seventy thousand on the debit side and seven thousand on the credit side, which is probably less. So here we'll take seventy thousand on both the side, get minus with seven thousand. Here you will get the difference of sixty three thousand as a closing balance for the year thirty first March two thousand thirteen by balance CF, which will become opening for the next year first April thirteen to balance. Brought forward with the value of sixty-three thousand at the end of the year, thirty-first March two thousand fourteen. Sixty-three thousand ten percent will be calculated and written down directly on the depreciation six thousand three hundred. Now again, if we make the total of both the side, here we find sixty-three thousand, here six thousand three hundred. So take sixty-three thousand at both the side. And get minus with six thousand three hundred, you will get the value of fifty six thousand seven hundred. That is on thirty first March two thousand fourteen by balance C F. Now here comes the third year, that is first April two thousand fourteen. To balance brought forward the closing of the last year, 
that is 56,700 will become opening balance. Then on 31st March 2015, just take the 10% of opening balance for the depreciation that is 5670. If we make the total both the side, obviously debit side is comparatively more. So we can take directly 56,700 at both the side and get minus with 5,670. Here we get 51,000. 30 as a closing balance for the year 31st March balance CF. Now we'll prepare depreciation account. Now for depreciation which will be calculated on 31st March 2013 for the first year that is to machinery account. For the first year we found the calculation was 7000. On 31st March 2014, oh sorry, 13, on the credit side, we'll write down profit and loss account with the same amount, which is going to be get daily with the both the side. So here we complete the first year with the amount 7,000. That's the end. Next year, we'll take the depreciation 6,300. That is 31st March 2014 to machinery account with the amount 6300. 31st March 2014 by profit and loss account on the credit side of the depreciation account with 6300. Get tally with the both the side 6300. 6300. Next, on 31st March, the last year, value of depreciation was 5,670. 31st March 2015, by profit and loss account on the credit side of depreciation, 5,670. Get tally with both the side. We can make a cross check here. 7,000, 6,300 and 5,670. Now they also ask journal entry. So first we'll write down the date of purchase. That is on 1st April 2012. Machinery account comes in with the amount 70,000. Where the main value will be written as a bank account. That is 67,000. To cash account 3,000. At the end of the year, that is on 31st March 2013, depreciation has been calculated, which will be written on debit side of machinery for the year, that is 7000 and given effect to the annual final account, that is, we'll keep in the profit and loss account, debited to depreciation account the same value 7000 for the year so here we complete first year next year that is 31st March 2014 we just going to calculate only the depreciation has to be written the depreciation account depreciation the second year amount is 6300 which will be on machinery Here I wrote for the end 31st March 2014 with the depreciation to machinery, profit and loss to depreciation and the depreciation for the second year was 6300. For the third year again the same entry with the amount 5670. So here we complete the journal entry and the depreciation account. Now the annual effect is remain which first have to be given for the two years annual effect for the first two years if we check the first year is ending on 31st March 2013 so just write down for the year 31st March 2013 for the profit and loss account and balance sheet first we'll write down the value of machinery for the first year it was 70,000 which will get minus at the 10% depreciation was 7,000 the value becomes 63,000 and the depreciation will be written on the profit and loss account debit side depreciation on machinery that is 7000 that is for the first year 
for second year that is 31st march 2014 don't forget to write down the date with the whole heading here the value on the next year machinery value was 63000 where we remove the depreciation as per reducing balance method is 6300 so the value remain is 56700 and the depreciation has to be written on the profit and loss account debit side depreciation on machinery that is 6300 so here we complete all the entries which has been asked in the question here is the calculation as per the reducing balance method here is the machinery account your first year this is for the first year and that's for the second year annual effect journal entry and depreciation 